This channel is supported by my online fishing courses, and you can learn more and get significant discounts at saltstrong.com slash Skinner. I'll have links to all of the gear in the video description, and if you like this video, please hit the like button. If you're not already a subscriber, please subscribe and hit that notification bell. Okay, heading out for some ocean jigging out of eastern Long Island. There's Doc all bundled up, and Cliff, and Jack, and Rick, and myself. And yes, yeah, snotty morning, but uh, yeah, we're going to go make the run anyway. And hey, w one of the things I want to compare and contrast this video is the fake hair bucktails versus the natural hair. And the uh, two things I'm going to look at, um, you know, I'm going to just stay with the synthetic the whole time. Um, will I be outfished by the others on the boat? And the other thing is, you know, I've always got a teaser on there. Am I going to see a disproportionate number of fish caught on the teaser as opposed uh, to the fake hair bucktail? So we'll see what happens. Beauty on. Beautiful. Oh, I'm coming up. I'll flip them in. Yeah. All right, Cliff starting off with a nice one. Hey, you know, another thing I'm going to look at, uh, we're going to see a color preference on this trip in terms of uh, the color gulp that they're preferring to hit. So that's going to be interesting as well. Hey, if any viewers that have uh, experience real hair versus the synthetics, uh, I would love to hear experiences and, and what other people think. There we go. Oh yeah. And uh, this is this is also going to be a netter. His. All right. Well, this isn't. This is a good one. I don't need you. Coming to you. That's all. Here we go. Yeah, that's a good one. Coming up and over. Oh, nice one, huh, John? Good enough. Nice. Very good. All right, so my first fish is on that synthetic hair bucktail. And why are we using synthetic hair? Um, the price of deer hair, deer tails, has gone through the roof. Um, you know, there's some supply issue. There's only one supplier. And uh, these bucktails require a lot of hair, especially when you get up four, five, six ounces. Um, so we've gone to synthetic. And I didn't think in the beginning it would make any difference with the fluke bucktails. I'm not sure about uh, with striper bucktails, but we're not using synthetics. And I'm talking about SNS bucktails who make the Skinner bucktails. Um, as far as I know, there aren't any striper bucktails being produced with the synthetics, but um, you know, definitely the fluke bucktails. And um, yeah, I've been poking around with them through the season. It takes a lot to get me to be convinced of something, and especially when you spend many years, you know, using something, um, it's hard to you know think about making a shift like that and uh, all right I'll talk about the differences between the two jigs in a second I got a good one coming up good one okay. coming up I'm out of the water I got that biggest one I had I know he's coming up fast but I think it, I'm just hydroplaning him Oh, he's not that good. No, Doc, I'm going to swing him over. He's a keeper. I know, but we don't need to tangle him in the net. Wow. Yeah, he's a keeper. Our limit is 18 and a half inches, and that's you know, definitely over that. Um, and again, it's on the bucktail, so it's 2-0 for me, um, bucktail versus teaser. So the synthetics, uh, one of the differences as opposed to natural hair is um, there's a little less drag because um, it's very smooth, the material. The other thing is um, they're it's not hollow like deer hair. Um, so you can actually use a, a slightly lighter weight bucktail um, going with the synthetic. And I'm not even talking like an ounce. I'm saying suppose three ounces was just borderline with deer hair. If you put a synthetic down, uh, it would be fine. So that's one difference. I'll talk about more in a second. Keeper coming up. Keeper coming up. I got the net. Good fish. And I, I dropped that line before you even got the motor, trolling motor on. Wow. So you dropped, you stopped right on top of this guy. Wow, you gonna get that net, Doc, or you gonna uh, sit down and read a book first? <laughs> I'm gonna do a root canal first. Oh, root canal. Nice fish. 
Nice fish. Nice fish. All right, so you stopped right on top of him. Wow. Okay, so now my catch is 3-0 uh, bucktail to teaser. All right, the synthetic bucktail is on the right, the real hair on the left. You can tell by looking at it that the... Um, the real hair is kind of a little bit rougher than the synthetic. Um, the synthetic seems to flare more when you tie it. Another thing about the synthetic is that it's a it's is more durable. If you catch a lot of fish on real hair, even if the bucktail is tied perfectly, the the hair is more brittle. It breaks, especially when you drag it on the bottom. So with time, you'll wear out real hair. Um, not so with the synthetic. Okay, here's a good one. There we go. Rick, you're out of the water. Oh yeah. shit. Ah, oh, mother. All right. Uh. Whoa. Don't worry. My line is loose. I'm not getting any uh, uh, dead to that guy. You won't let my dick. Oh no, I gotta get the. I'll take care of him. Right. He's. I'm gonna have to measure him anyway, although I think he's good. Yeah, he's a definitely a keeper. So that's two keepers on this drift. So let's go out there where it's rough. Yeah, good idea. Nobody else is catching. Well, nobody else switched over to Blue Fuse. Yeah, the discussion is going towards moving or not moving. Uh, you know, I'm a firm believer in staying where there's fish, as is Doc. Uh, you know, if Cliff goes 30 seconds without a fish, he, he wants to make a run. Um, so, yeah, there's a lot of discussion about that. Oh, there you go. Oh, he dropped it on purpose. Oh, yeah. Okay, he, uh, Doc, Rick definitely needs the net. Nice, nice fish came back. Rick, give me the net. I want it. Hey, let's stay here. No. Let's go. <laughs> Let's not stay here. Yeah, everybody else in the boat's using uh, real hair bucktails. Uh, Doc occasionally puts a chicken rig on, but uh, not too much this trip. Oh. So I can see. Oh, can you see? <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's a guppy. Oh, this is a big ass fish. It's a nice fish. This is, this is the pool fish so far. Uh oh, this, uh -oh. this is definitely it's, a DD. It's a, it's a snag skate. This is my PBDD. It's the sweetest yeah. in the ass. Here it comes. All right, I'm going to bring it around here. What a monster. Okay. Nice. Let's get out of here. All right? Let's get out of here, right, Rick? Yeah, let's go. Let's go to the stupid philosophy. You look. Just stay where the fish are. Doc. Listen, here's a good analogy. Yeah. You love Doritos, right? Yeah. <laughs> Do you eat Doritos six hours in a row? Oh, no. Yeah. Okay, so the fish turn on and off. Well, they don't eat we, constantly. We, we, we. They're here. I eat Doritos. Oh, and what color did you catch him on? Oh, blue fuse. Yeah, everybody, blue fuse, blue fuse. Hey, number 10 going in the box here. You need a net up there? Yeah. Okay, okay, I'm, I'm coming. All right, the camera was off. I had a, another small keeper, and again, uh, on the jig. So I'm looking at the 5-0 jig to teaser. And that's out of 10 keepers total on the boat. So that's, you know, four guys have accounted for five, and I've got five. So, hey, looking good on the synthetic hair. You know, I he don't... Uh, he knows how to keep moving. Thank you. It felt good in the beginning, then it just felt like nothing, like it was on a little tiny fish. All right, so we only got three keepers on that drift and lost a couple, but, you know... Not bad. Oh, what color? Blue fuse. Say it louder. Blue fuse. Blue fuse. And we did leave that spot and came out where it's rougher. And hey, we've been on the trolling motor the whole time to help slow the drift with the wind going with the current. Yeah. Nope. This is a big ass fish. Is it? Yeah. Yeah. It is. Yeah. Doc's gonna get you. He's up. I'll get you in there. Yeah, I got it. Hold on, stop it, my drag. I might play that. There's a net. Come on, come on, Mr. Shaw. Probably a skate. Some old shoe. Look at that foam bed. Where's the fish? It's coming. Here it comes. Big 
Yes, blue. Nice. Blue. Nice. Blue. Nice. Blue. Nice. Blue. nice. Blue. Got him. Nice, Ricky. Oh, Double digit. Yeah. Well, nice fish, dude. Hey. Huh? Huh? Our I wallet. Yeah, should have knocked it off in the net. Wallet. Right here. Deal with it. Hey. I gotta get back in the water. Blue fuse. Blue fuse. When I buy gulp, and yeah, I buy it. People think I'm on the payroll with these people and they send it to me. I've spent over $800 on this stuff this year. Anyway, the colors I buy, white glow, salmon red, blue fuse, pink shine. John's in. I can, uh, I can deal with it. Right. It's probably a keeper. Definitely a keeper. That's a keeper. Yep. All right, on the teaser finally. So that's five on the jig, one on the teaser for me. I normally split about 50 50. And a lot of times I hear people say, I get all my fish on the teaser. Anybody who is saying that then has some issue with the bucktail. Either it's too heavy, I don't know what. The okay, hook is too big, but you should see about 50 50. Oh yeah, I like that. Oh, this feels like a better fish. I don't think I'm flipping this one. There you go. Yeah. Nice. Alright, that one hit the blue fuse as well, and he does have a pink shine on there, so the fish had a choice. How could I drop that? Oh my god. Yeah, you got one down there. The hits were so so clean. Oh there he is. Alright, now I got a, a netter. Netted your fish, Cliff. I got it. Uh, he's not gonna be as big as Cliff's fish, though. Yeah, well, we'll see. Well, he's a netter anyway, right? Yeah. All right, the teaser's catching up for me. It's five on the jig and two on the teaser. We'll see. Maybe not. Are you on the bottom? Or you got a fish, huh? Oh, you got a good one. All right. Yeah, that's oh, that's a big fish. That's a big fish. I'm going to get out. So like I said, we're using the trolling motor the whole time, and we're all using four-ounce bucktails. That's a, yeah, that's a good fish. That's a short. All right, here we go. That's a good fish. Where's oh man, that's a nice. There you go, Ricky. Nice. Where you go, Ricky? Yeah. Right. <laughs> Beautiful. That. Eight plus. That's a wide yeah. fish. Yeah, yeah, it is a wide fish. Dude, I thought I was on the bottom again. Well, he's he's I, hooked funny I too. So too. But yeah, no, that's look at the 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 Beautiful. height and the width. Right. Beautiful. Beautiful fish, Rick. And that was another blue fuse fish. Oh. Red caker. Oh, come on! Oh, son of a bitch. You've got to be kidding me. Good hook set. Just drop in and let a lot of fun land. Don't come back. He's, he's pissed now. He's bad. Ah, you got to love their how stupid they are. And it's a big fish. Oh, uh, yeah, I'm coming up. That's a big fish. Boy, he was not going to take no for an answer. I have a whole pack of those. Where's the net? There's the net. Okay, I got it. I got it. I got it. Oh. 
my color. Mm. I think he's fat. No. It's a big, it's a big fish. Oh, nice Come body. On. Nice one, John. Just love the uh, coming back, coming back. Coming yeah, back. yeah, I love that. That's great. Yeah. All right. That's great. At least I limited. There's some bigger fish out here now. Hard to 100 yards, 50 yards. I can't believe how much I've gone through. I, I'm, I'm almost about to run out. Oh, look at this! I'm not that mad. Somebody's got to get the net because I can't. Through. This is the kind of fish Rick catches. Hey, I'm in the corner. I just don't want to get in this no drama. This is a good one, huh? Yeah, yeah. Cool. Right, we have just color. duck down when he comes in, huh? Because I'm gonna go over your head with it. He's not that. He's, he's a nice one. Nice. You know what I mean? nice. Yeah. Nice. One left. That's a good fish, dude. Yeah. Okay, and on the jig. So it ended up for me. I had six on the jig two on the teaser, total of eight. Uh, we had a boat limit, so the rest of the boat combined for 12 fish, so I did very well compared to the rest of the boat. And the jig far outproduced the teaser, so yeah, I'm, I'm perfectly fine now with the synthetic. Uh, you know, it took me a while to come around, um, you know, just because that's the way I am, but nope, it's good. Uh, I'm just going to keep using them for fluke. They, uh, they work fine, and uh, yeah, we'll see about the bass. You know, I, I need to give it give it a shot. So, all right, if you like this video, please hit the like button. If you're not already a subscriber, please subscribe and hit that notification bell. Check out my online courses, saltstrong.com slash Skinner. And don't forget to leave comments, synthetic versus real hair preferences.